This video will show you how to replace the retractable insect screen on a self-storing storm door. The procedures outlined here can be applied to the following storm doors. The Anderson 10 Series Panel Ventilating Storm Door, the MCO 400 Series Self-Storing Storm Door, and the MCO Traditional Deluxe Single Vent Storm Door. You'll need safety glasses, masking tape, scissors, a Phillips screwdriver, a quarter inch nut driver or flat blade screwdriver, and a drill with a 7 64 inch bit, as well as a replacement retractable insect screen, available from your Anderson dealer or parts.andersonstormdoors.com. You may also need a second person to assist you to steady the door. Before you begin, find the service guide that came with your replacement parts. Be sure to read it completely, including all the cautions and warnings. You can also download the guide at andersonstormdoors.com. If you need to familiarize yourself with the terminology in this video, we recommend clicking here to watch a video on identifying the parts of self-storing storm doors. To begin, position the prop rod that came with your replacement parts on the ledge of the lower window as shown. Tape the prop rod to the glass. Next, open the door. Slide the hold open washer on the closer as shown to keep the door open. Release the latch handle and lower the ventilating window until it rests on the prop rod. The retractable insect screen is stored inside the door with a highly tightened spring and may release suddenly causing injury or product damage. Maintain a firm grasp when detaching the insect screen from the window. Using scissors, cut through the insect screen cloth horizontally along the entire width. Once cut, the insect screen will rapidly wind itself up. Using a Phillips screwdriver, remove the two screws and the window latch assembly and save for reuse. If your storm door has a rivet located between the two window latch mounting holes, it will need to be removed. Using a 7 64 inch drill bit, drill through the center of the rivet until the rivet head separates from the rivet body. Remove the rivet and dispose of properly. Using a nut driver or flat blade screwdriver, remove the screws from the insect screen cover plate and save for reuse. Once loose, the insect screen cover plate may be removed by lifting up and towards you. Save the cover plate for reinstallation. To remove the insect screen track retainer, use pliers to pull the bottom of the retainer away from the door and work your way up. Remove the retainer and insect screen latch rail. Use the same process to remove the retainer on the opposite side. Remove the retractable insect screen and dispose of properly. Starting on the left side, position the replacement screen track retainer with the weather strip of the retainer on the interior side. Starting at the bottom, use your thumb to press the retainer in place as shown. Remove any rubber bands around the new insect screen if present. Install the replacement insect screen with the screen pulled down and toward the inside of the home. Next, slide the right screen track retainer over the edge tab of the insect screen assembly. Starting at the top, use your thumb to press the retainer in place as shown. Reinstall the previously removed insect screen cover plate Make sure that the edge of the insect screen cover plate hooks over the lip at the top of the door. Secure the insect screen cover plate to the door using the previously removed screws. Using a drill with a 7 64 inch bit, enlarge the center hole in the insect screen latch rail. Then, insert the provided tie wrap through the hole and create a loop. Using a screwdriver, pull the insect screen down and then towards you so that it clears the window latch rail. 
Align the holes in the latch rail with the holes in the window rail so that they interlock. While holding the insect screen latch rail in position, use scissors to cut the tie wrap and remove it. Use the previously removed screws to attach the window latch to the insect screen pull and window frame. Dispose of the tie wrap properly. Raise the ventilating window to its highest position. Slide the hold open washer back and close the door. Finally, remove the prop rod and dispose of properly. Congratulations! You have successfully replaced the retractable insect screen on your storm door. If you have questions about care, maintenance, or repair, call our customer care center at 800 933 3626 or visit the Help Center in the service section of our website at andersonstormdoors.com. Anderson, customer care is what we care about most.